first practice. It feels good to be aesthetic. And then, you know, I had fun. So hopefully, I'll be back on the floor on Wednesday. Any question? How close are you to being 100%? Do you have a watch? Yeah. Probably 48 hours. Oh, really? Yeah. Do you think you'll be ready to play? Yeah, I think I'll be able to have my team. So I went to practice, no pain. And I told you guys that uh, I was going to be ready in two weeks. So, you know, finally two weeks in. So I'm very happy that I could go through practice with my teammates. And, you know, it's tough. Though. How do you feel in tune with the rest of the team? It feels good. I mean, uh, look around. Uh, it's 17 mm -hmm. banners. So, you know, I'm, uh, I'm in a great spot. You know, I just want to walk out to make myself a game of head about my team and be ready to go on Wednesday. Do you think it's not fair for you? Obviously, I've been, no, obviously, I've been playing here for, for so eight months, so I'm not going to be making pictures from, from the first one. But, you know, defensively, you can always help your team to do this thing to make you uh, be a great team. So hopefully, if I get in the game Wednesday, even five minutes or ten minutes, whatever, I'm going to help my team. Doc has talked a lot about toughness, and that's what he thinks maybe this team can improve upon the you know, first eight games of the season. How can you help this team be well, tough? That's why I was excited. That's why you know, I wanted to, to be a Celtic. Because I think that uh, on the floor, me and KG and all the guys, we can bring that toughness that Boston had when I, we, we played them. They, they were so tough and it was hard for us to get a shot. So I'm trying to get the same mindset. So get in the game, play hard, and make sure that we work hard. And at the end of the day, we get a W. How tough have these two weeks been, kind of just waiting? No, it was, it was a good two weeks. Obviously, you know, I got to see downtown Boston a little bit, you know, <laughs> read newspaper, Boston blogs, all stuff like that. So. And obviously, there's the snow yet. It's a good thing. <laughs> Summertime in Boston. No, it's, I've been watching my teammates, I've been watching a lot, a lot of fear. I'm learning from it, so I think that, you know, on Wednesday, I'll be ready. How do you like the city so far? Huh? <laughs> it's nice. I mean, it's, it's pretty nice. People, people love basketball, people love uh, their Celtics, so, you know. You guys too, right? Yeah. <laughs> so if you guys need to eat French cheese, or French whatever, or French steak, or frit, or something like that, you know, come back to my house and we get it done. <laughs> so, but not Wednesday, you'll be busy. No, on day off, a day off. Yeah. We, we do that um, a month from now. Let's take free it a little bit, huh? <laughs> a French sauce. Yeah. Continue out there working on the side with, with Brian, you, whatever. Obviously, you can do a bunch of things. Was it hard to be patient during the last two weeks and not want to try to get out right now? No, it wasn't hard to be patient because my knee wasn't allowing me to play basketball. But, you know, I've been pushing myself hard to be on the floor today. And obviously, that was my first practice, so I felt better. I felt more comfortable. So, hopefully, tomorrow's practice, I feel myself again and, and then be ready for Wednesday. And, you know, there's 58 games left, so, you know. I don't have a lot of time to think about the season because the playoffs are going to come so fast. So, you know, I just try to push myself, learn the play, and, you know, at night, try to learn the play again and make myself available for my team on Wednesday. And Wednesday is going to be a great day for me. <laughs> <laughs> Were you out here yesterday too? Of course. Yeah. I, 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 practiced, I practiced yesterday with my team. You know, I'm excited. So, is this your third practice? Yeah, I'm finally at Celtic. Yeah. Third practice. Third. You don't seem too excited. <laughs> I'm always excited. Something you guys have to know about Michael Petrus. I always have a smile on my face, no matter what the situation is, because you never know in life. So that's it. I love you guys so much that I gotta go. So